interesting style, especially that blocking method of just standing there and taking it. Ugh, what is this guy? All of us beating on him and it's like he doesn't even feel it. You want more? Ugh, I'm not leaving till I, till I at least punch that uppity bitch out. Well, well. If it isn't Porky's little friends. I saw you boys crawling in the bars last night. Ah, but I must be hearing things. Because it sounded like you said something about punching a bitch out. If you're interested, this bitch is ready to go. No, ma'am. That's just crazy. What kind of man you would punch a lady? With with a group? So pathetic. <laughs> right. Now pick up that sad sack lying over there and get the hell out of my sight. I got what I came for here for. Got no use for him now. Y yes, ma'am. Old man, been a while. Yeah. Same old Mitsutatsu, strong as a bear on bearoids. Okay, I don't know what a bearoid would be. You're one to talk, old man. She says, you're one to talk, old man. That implies that he's really strong as well, which we already knew though. So, can you introduce me to my knight in shining armor here? What? Oh, right. This here is my latest find. A real diamond in the rough. Name's Kiryu. Kitty you, huh? I'll remember the name. If you got back, uh, if you got old man singing your praises, you gotta be pretty tough. Yes. He is. This boy here is a future champion. I'll st I'd stake my career on it. Ah, okay. Now I'm seeing what this is. You're thinking Kitty here's your ticket to a stack of cash, stack of cash, which you'll then use to pay me back so we get to stay friends. Easy, Tiger. I told you it'd take a while, but. You'll get it all back. Oh, and speaking of favors, why don't you train the boy here? Wait, what? Do I seem like the patient teacher type to you? Sorry, no can do. No. No, don't be like that. We both need him to get stronger. Once he's a champ, we'll be rolling in the dough. Besides, I know you're secretly the doting type. He'll make a champion a hell of a lot faster with you beating him into shape. That means you get peed sooner, see? Win, win, win. Boy. Old man, what do you think you're doing here? Yeah. Negotiating an apprenticeship with Miss Tatsu for you, obviously. Trust me. You train under her, you'll be a master in the of the ring in no time flat. Uh. <laughs> Come on, cutie, you accept help. You're insane. I'm in seriously hot water right now. I don't have the time to humor your little fantasies. Yes, you do. You have time to go helping some like random band. What? You're in hot water too, my boy? You talking about the knife in the ribs here? Because I warned you about that. Or are we talking about? Okay. I'll be lucky if that's all I get. And seriously, what's this obsession with me getting stabbed about? All right, chuckleheads, that's enough. Neither one of you is making a damn bit of sense. But I hear where you're coming from, old man. This is the championship talk, and just saying you care about this kid you kid. If you're worried about him, own it. Look. He did me a solid a minute ago. I can do this. Besides, the old man is right that my training will make a real man out of you. <laughs> okay. Hop a cab out to the pier sometime. Oh, I got a training space there. Okay, the pier. I know where that is. You train at the pier? You got it. Kind of live there too. Give me a visit sometime. See for yourself. I think you'll like the digs. The digs? Anyway, that was my last job in the city, so I'm headed back to base. Kiryu, you, me, Pierre, training. I'll be waiting. So, all those different... Old man, I've got a, already got a future planned. I'm sorry, but I can't be your champion. What's what are we even talking about? Boxing? Not that it matters. I can't. So, there's like a bunch of different taxis out of this city. And the one that I took before just so happened to lead to the pier. Do they all lead to different areas though? I'm getting that impression now that all these different taxis actually take you to different areas? I don't know if that's true or not, but we'll have to check. If that's true, I have a lot of exploring to do. Oh, I know that. Doesn't mean I'll stop trying. But I know when to stop making a nuisance of myself. I'll give you some space, champ. It's about time for my afternoon drink anyway. Help me clear my head. He wants us to make money. Why would we not trust it? Why would we not like go with that? Because we want money right now. We really need money to upgrade our abilities and stuff. Lots of money. 
Good luck with that. Just don't have too many. You think a guy called uh, Old Man can't hold his wine? Ha! What is that? What does his name even mean? Does his name have uh, some meaning in in so like the Japanese characters that create that name that I can't pronounce? Does that mean something about being able to hold your wine? See around, boy. Keep those ribs knife free now. Yeah, he seems to be obsessed with that. Okay, get out of here. And thanks. I'll be careful. Well, that was interesting and uh, very profitable since we got a new um, a ma attack style. Didn't expect to get wrapped up in that mess, but at least I didn't come way empty handed, exactly. Now, back to looking for leads on Tashibana real estate. Nope. That's not what we're doing. We're absolutely not looking for leads on Tachibana real estate. Instead, we are saving so we don't have to do any of that again. And then after that, we are going and looking at the map find the nearest car, which is over here. So let's head over there. And we're gonna go talk to that lady immediately. Oh, another thing? Hey there, buddy, I'm looking for you. You again. You got a lot of nerve showing up now. What do you want? This guy's a Yakuza. I think it's pretty clear what I want. Time to play your protection money, pal. If you're doing business in Kamu Kamuruku, you need, you're need doing business with us. The hell with that? It's not protection money if you don't show up to actually protect me when I need it. And you have the gall to ask for more? They're not protecting you from other people, they're protecting you from themselves. This is a, a tax for... This is a, t a money you pay so that you don't get beat up by him. When you need it? What are you talking about? I'm talking about the Tajibana real estate. When they came and chased me out, you people were nowhere in sight. Some protection. Oh, or maybe it is actually. I guess it is technically protection from other gangs going on their turf. Tachibana. Interesting. What? Oh, Tachibana real estate. Yeah, they're. Look, it's complicated. Complicated my ass. You got scared and ran away. What could be simple? Simpler. S scared? What do you. Who do you think. Thanks to you, I have to relocate. Now I'm scrambling to get new customers to make up for all the ones I lost. I couldn't pay you even if I wanted to. I think you better keep that attitude in check, asshole. Nah, uh, you're the one who needs to actually do something, it seems like. Mind if I cut in? Huh? What do you want? Who are you? What family are you with? I'm not in anybody's family. And pipe down. It's this guy I'm talking to. Interesting that this guy doesn't recognize Kiryu. Haven't we been in this town for a while as a yakuza this isn't a this is a small area shouldn't we all know each other to a certain extent maybe not i'm not in anybody's family pipe down it's this guy i'm talking to you. excuse me what do you want from me you say you opened a shop here because tachibana real estate forced you out of your last location is that right oh i see what this is you're trying to be this guy's new muscle oh hell no what our family handled this handled this cafe's protection for 30 years. You try and swoop in on our turf, it'll mean war. War with a me? Oh no. Looks like you need some convincing to stay quiet while I speak to the owner here. Shut your mouth and try me. I'll kill you. Well, this shouldn't be too bad. Just one guy, right? He's not, uh... He's not, what's his name? He's not Kuze. Alright, I guess I'm using this style. I'll just... Block? Oh, well, that doesn't work. We really fall over easily. It's kind of saddening. Alright, we'll use a cone on him. Have a cone time. There we go. That's the way to do it. Yeah, it's a bit of a slow style. Switch to something a little bit faster again. I like how the music changes when we do that, too. When you switch styles, we get different music. Boom! There we go. That wasn't too hard. You actually gave us a ton of money, wow. 2 million yen. What the hell? I'm not losing to some kid. Does he really look like a kid? I don't know what, what universe these people come from, but Kiryu 
He does really doesn't look like a kid to me. <laughs> you just did. Now get lost and don't turn your face around this shop again. Elsewise. Damn it. This ain't over. Yeah, whatever you say. There. Now we can finally talk in peace. So what? In the end, you're just taking his place as the guy squeezing me for protection money? Please, can you just leave me alone? I already said it wasn't like that. Not even Yakuza. I really just want to talk to for a minute. So I wasn't meaning to get uh, progress on the on the storyline, but that's what we're getting right now, I guess. Talk about what? Touch about a real estate. I'm doing a little investigation. I'd like you to tell me what you know. Anything is fine. What I know is the hell of a lot. Besides, I'd prefer never to deal with those guys again. They're terrifying. Terrifying? How? What do they do to you? It's not even what they did. They just knew about me, like everything about me. I mean, we had a similar experience. Like what? My parents' home address? My daughter's school? Where I source all the cafe supplies? Well, my customers are? With all that, with that much ammo, they didn't have to do anything. They didn't have to do anything. And to top it off, they're not even Yakuza. At least with that lot, you know what to expect. You see. And where would I go if I wanted to meet the guy from Tachibana's office who paid to do that visit? Uh, they're probably still there, finishing what they started. So where? The Hakua building on Shif and Shichifuku Shif 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 Street. The place where my cafe was in. They've driven most of the tenants out, so the place is practically empty. There was one stubborn guy who said the only way he was leaving was in a casket. Are you still there? Probably. They were making him all kinds of sweet deals, but he turned down every last one. If he's still there now, touch on his boys will be too. Go have a look if you really want to get mixed up with them. Alright, thanks. I appreciate it. Tachiban has been running tenants out of the Hakwa building on Shifu Ch Shichifuku Street. Worth checking out. Where's that at? Shichifuku Street. It's here. That's actually where I was going to go to take a ride, so I guess we're not going there just yet. <laughs> Alright, fine. We'll take a ride from a different street. Because I don't want to do that just yet. Before I do anything else, I want to go find that lady. See if she can teach us anything about that new fighting style. Someone say something? Would someone say like something? Was it you again? Probably not. Checking the map. Yep, it's at the end of this. What is she giving me? More tissues? Yeah, more tissues. What the heck? I don't want any tissues. Why are people handing out tissues? More tissues? Everyone just keeps handing out tissues. I don't get it. Alright, let's use this vending machine while we're here. Might as well. What do we get? Expired lunch set. Ew. Okay, well, that was... That was clearly not good. <laughs> it was not a good roll. More tissues. Alright, let's take this... Taxi. And let's head to the pier. Okay, so I think they all probably go to the same areas. I think I was wrong about them going to different places. Which is perfectly fine. Alright, here's the person, and there's a tra training dummy. Interesting. Okay. This light place looks definitely pretty nice in uh, the daytime. What's this all about? It seems like mini gamey stuff. Like, destroy all the mannequins and boxes for points or some nonsense we're gonna be doing here. Yeah, I got curious about the training you mentioned. Glad you remembered. Can't trust a word on that old drunk, that old drunk says, really. Hey, I'm not like him. Oh, relax, I'm just messing with you. Shall we get started? Sure. Uh. I'm all ears. Miss Tatsu's training, sub story is 91. How many sub stories are there? Is that like the, the actual number that, <laughs> is like the actual index number of the sub story? My training method is simple. Just grab whatever you can, swing it around, and throw it until everything's smashed to hell. Yep, sounds like it's a point-based smashing thing. Sounds like just taking your frustration out on things, but I guess there's got to be more to it than that. 
Uh, does this help you Im impound furniture when you go collect? <laughs> Pretty much. It takes muscle and explosive force to grab heavy objects and swing them around quickly. This gives you the oof you need. I see. No taking your time with it either. You have to be under pressure as if it's a real situation. There's no point in the training. A real situation? You mean when collecting a debt? I guess you're pretty used to a rough time. Hey, don't act like you don't know. I may even call on you to help me out sometime. Okay, can we make money that way? Nani. Huh? You want me to go out and collect for you? You've done it before, kid you. This is not you're not a stranger to that line of work. Hey, let's not jump to any uh, jump any guns here. First, what I want you to do this training and get a feel for it, all right? Uh. Yeah, I got it. We'll start with a primer. This way. Yep, that's exactly as I expected. Points and dummies, and we have to smash them in this probably time limit. Mannequins are filled with play money, which bursts out when you break them. Bucks of money one too. And to smash all the mannequins before the time runs out. And recover a set amount of money. You get to start? Yeah. X for doing the thing. Okay. Uh. I bought 120 seconds, got it. 120 seconds just to beat up these mannequins? That shouldn't be too bad. Right. I'm going right yeah. first. Whack, whack, whack. Aren't we supposed to kill these? We are able to destroy these mannequins, right? Or am I wrong about that? Or is it just the boxes? That works. that 30 box over there so are the boxes filled with money or is it the mannequins that are filled with money that I still don't fully really understand well this isn't too bad Alright, if I'm facing the wrong direction, I probably don't want to use the attack button. I just want to pick up. Unless I'm facing the right direction already. Like now. Do I need to get all these boxes? I don't remember what set amount of money I needed to get. But that's every box, isn't it? I guess that's it. Okay, it looks like the mannequin does have health, so we should be able to kill it. Alright, that works, hopefully. I assume that was enough. What do you think? Pretty tough training, right? Yeah, I haven't done anything like this before. That'll make it even harder next time. Be ready. Uh. Great. By the way, I have to ask you to pay if you want to keep going with this. I can only do so much charity work. Understood. Okay. It's fine by me. How much do, you give, do we have to pay? Uh. I'm going to beast mode? Sure. Um... Well, we uh, we almost reached two million last time, so let's do tell me two million. Whoa, that's pretty expensive. Okay, we got plenty of money though. All right, this could be tough. What what happened there? What? Oh, what? There's one with a gun. What the heck is with this one? Shooting at us. Clearly we need to get rid of this guy quick. There we go. 
Alright, now we shouldn't have to worry anymore. Alright, that might have cost us, but we'll see how well we do. This looks like we're still making money pretty easily here. Just sprint along. There we go, we're at 2 million already. That wasn't too bad. Yeah, as far as, um, oh, that roll is pretty fast too. Oh. <laughs> also seems like we can speed ourselves up by uh, pushing the box. Like that. Yeah, this isn't too bad. We're already well beyond the target. Easy. Wonder how much harder it gets. A lot of these mini games have been incredibly difficult, but this one seems to be not too bad at all. Almost at four million now. Well, we'll just beat up on this guy. I don't think we can go get to that box that quick. Might as well kill this guy while we're here. There we go. And we did it. Probably. At least I assume we did. I didn't expect they had shot though in the middle of it. Surprised the tutorial didn't cover that. Nice try, but trying isn't always going to cut it, huh? Wait, what? We failed? The key to doing this training well is to pick up junk as you attack the mannequins. You'll run out of time if you break them, try to break them separately. Wait, we had to break all of them? Crap! <laughs> okay, apparently we had to break all the mannequins. And that was the point. Do that again. Alright, I thought we were supposed to reach a money target, but... Apparently I was wrong about that. Well, first off, we obviously need to take care of this guy, that guy first. Ow. Alright. No. This guy needs to go away. There we go. Now we gotta take care of these guys completely. Yeah, we just have to take them out. So it says you need to pick up boxes to not run out of time, but just beating at them like this seems to work out real alright, honestly. Okay, yeah, it seems to work out okay. Don't know how much we really need to use these boxes, but we're gonna use them. They definitely hurt a lot. Keep whacking. Hopefully we make it in time. Looks like we're already running low on time. Nice. That's another one down. Come on. Keep whacking him. Smash. Might have lost too much time. Let's see. Not exactly what I wanted to do there, but whatever. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to do it in time. Come on, mannequin, go away. Yeah, this is not going to work. 
No good. Huh. It's way more difficult than I expected. And we failed. Still two mannequins left, wow. Roughly the same amount of money. Yeah, no good. Alright, we'll stop that for now. Let's uh, actually no, let's not stop that for now. Uh. Let's um let's do the first one, the easier one. That shouldn't be too bad. And we'll at least be able to get something. Here we go. So we gotta kill all the mannequins. Smashing. Whack, whack, whack. More boxes. One of them down. Waste a lot of time though. Only get only get two minutes. And we've only killed one mannequin. And we're almost down to half. Yeah, looks like we're gonna fail this one too. Is. These boxes are useful, but they honestly don't do enough to make this work. This ain't gonna work. Oh, this is possible, to be honest. We're so far away from victory. Yeah, again, two mannequins left. No point in doing anything. Huh. How does this work? Yeah, nice try. Yeah, you know, pick up junk. Yeah, yeah, press X to attack. Alright, that was really, um, it was weird. Alright. I don't know where exactly we want to go. I don't know what the named places are. It's definitely way harder than I thought it was going to be. Alright, let me check the map. Something's going on over there. What is it? Let's find out. Oh, some more random people to beat up. Oh, fine. Surprised that right there isn't a quick time event. There we go. Whack everybody. This is great for crowd control. <laughs> Was he just trying to tank that attack? There we go. Slowly scuttle towards you. There we go. Easy. Alright, what's going on here? Hmm? Is that... Is that Mina? Oh, right. The person we were trying to stalk. Her boyfriend wants to know how she's making so much cash. Um... No, well, what's nearby? Anything in particular? It doesn't look like it. Oi. Hello, random person. You really shouldn't be... Ta you really shouldn't trust us. Hey, can I talk to you for a minute? Uh, sure. Are you a customer? Nani. What? Customer? Mm. Don't tell me. This girl's really selling herself? Oh, sorry. I guess not. Do you want something? No, I shouldn't jump to conclusions. I'll try to keep the conversation going in secret and figure out what she's doing. 
Uh, this is all new to me. That's a vague thing to say. It's all right, it's all new to me. I don't know where to begin. Could you tell me how this works? Oh, so you're a first time customer. That's why you were uh, so tentative. Um, sorry, the first time can be awkward and embarrassing. I have a feeling it's not what they're trying to make it out to be. <laughs> there, I think I managed to get the ball rolling. This girl's a little sweary too. So, uh, what would you like? Hmm? What do you mean? Um, well, top or bottom, which do you want? Nani. Top or bottom? <laughs> this girl talking about position? It sounds like she's giving customers the option of being the top or the bottom, but I have to keep up this charade to figure out if she's really selling her body. I'm sure it's not the case. But what could she actually be meaning? I don't know. Um, top or bottom, what she prefer? Uh, top? Uh, t top? Top. My bra, then. Please hold on. What? Huh? <laughs> Your bra? Pardon? You said you wanted the top, didn't you? Well, yeah, I did. But why your underwear? I don't get it. Uh, I'm sorry if you misunderstood, but I'm a... Brucera girl? Uh, what? <laughs> That's not a word I know. Nah, same for me. Surfer Buruma and Serafuku. You know, bloomers and sailor suits. But I said girls sell gym clothes, school uniforms, a lot of other stuff they've worn before. That's exactly what I was saying. <laughs> You're sailing your bath water and, uh, and stuff like that. <laughs> Okay, well, it's, yeah, that's, ba that's not far off from selling your body. In my case, though, I just sell my underwear. Sell your used underwear? Who would buy that? I'm sure plenty of people. And why? Why? I guess men used them to do pervy things. What else would it be? I don't really want to think about it. Uh, okay, I get it. You're doing business with men who get excited over your secondhand skivvies. <laughs> don't judge. You're the one trying to buy it. No, actually, if you're not going to buy my underwear, then go away. I don't want to stand here talking to a pervert. Ready? What? Hey. Hmm. Great. She's totally shut down now. I'm the adult here. I better set her straight. Uh, what's the right thing to say here out of all these lines? Um, you shouldn't have just ignore someone. Uh, I don't know. Can you admit you send, sell your underwear? Why would we need her to admit that? We already know that. She already admitted that. What's wrong with being a pervert? That's true. What is wrong with being a pervert? I want to know what that is. What's wrong with being a pervert? Huh? Sure. A guy who gets excited over used underwear might be a pervert. So what? Have they ever caused you any trouble? No, they made you money. Uh, people all over their kinks. Who are you to shame another person for what they enjoy? Yeah. Nobody has that right. You can't judge someone just because they don't conform to society's standards of sexual normalcy. Uh, it depends on what, what, uh, what, I don't know, there's some things that you can, you may, you might have to judge, but for the most part I agree, kid you. Mm. Whoa, I really lost it there. I think she's repulsed. Better set her straight some other way. Okay, apparently that didn't work. You shouldn't just ignore someone. Apparently that was the wrong answer. Hey, you shouldn't just ignore someone who's talking to you. I'm trying to tell you something. Pretending you don't hear me is rude. Knowing someone hurts their feelings. Can't you put yourself in their situation? I have nothing to say uh. to a pervert. What? Well, I need to calm down. I can't just let a high school girl get under her skin. Besides, telling someone not to ignore you when there already are is a waste of time. Better split <laughs> Okay, so it's, uh, <laughs> you just have to keep picking until you get the right answer. It's very Danganronpa. Um, but how is this the right thing? She already admitted. Would you admit the other people, would you admit to other people that you sell underwear? Can you be proud of that? Huh? Can you tell your parents, siblings, friends, or your boyfriend to the, uh, that people purchase your panties? I touch on, right? How do you know my name? Should be her answer. Your boyfriend is worried about you. That's very suspicious. Makes you very suspicious that you would know all that. Huh? How do you know about Tachan? Actually, he put me up to this. He thought maybe you were selling your body. He wanted me to find out for sure. Tachan thought I would do that? I would never sell myself. I mean, that's sort of what you're doing. 
just in a kind of way. Right, you're not selling your body. What you're doing is, what was the word again? Borussera? But whether you're marketing your underwear or your body, I think they're still bo both about <laughs> selling your sex. Yeah, it's sort of, sort of similar. Or can you proudly tell your boyfriend you do, you do Borussera? I, I don't... Hmm? I don't, I don't want to do this either. Okay, well you're making tons of money on it and apparently you're flaunting it in lots of ways. So, do you really need all that money if you're spending it so casually? Um, listen, I'm sorry for getting all emotional on you. No, it's alright. I might have been too harsh. I didn't give you the chance to explain. Honestly, I never wanted to do this thing. Was it for money? Some of us are in it for that, but not me. Really? I mean, it's nice having money, but it doesn't make me happy at all to buy things with money. I got by selling my old panties. Guess not. I'm just afraid, so, so afraid of Sachiko. What? Mm -hmm. Sachiko? She runs things for all the girls, in the, those girls in the area. Sachiko figures out where we should be standing on the street. She also takes care of things if they're in any trouble with the customer. So she's putting her up to this. In return, we all have to submit a part of our earnings to Sachiko once a month. So there's a girl overseeing the operation. Can't you tell Sachiko you want to quit? Yeah. That's impossible. As long as she's around, I can't quit because I could quit doing this thing. The high school girls all, all around here around here are all Sachiko's friends. If I tried to stand up to her or quit, they'd all bully me. Okay, so that's the real reason why. So you can't quit, huh? This is all sounding awfully familiar. I, I don't want to sell my underwear anymore. Mm. It's getting pretty complex. Her boyfriend won't be able to solve this on his own. So time to go beat that lady up, probably. Mina, you know, do you know where I can find this Sachiko? I do, but why would you want to know? I don't want to go back. I don't want to go back to your boyfriend and tell him that you are peddling your panties. So I thought maybe I could persuade Sachiko to quit running this sketchy uh, ring. What? Really? You do all that? You do that? It'd be wonderful if that worked, but I'm not sure Sachiko can be persuaded so easily. It's worth a try. Where can I find Sachiko? I think she's doing her Burusera shift near the hotel district. She's a long-haired girl wearing a Sakurazaki Academy's uniform. A long-haired girl near the hotel district. Got it. I don't know if Sakurazaki Academy uniform though. Oh, I guess not. Sakurazaki's uniform is a white collar and a blue scarf. White collar, blue scarf. All right. Sachiko sometimes wears a cardigan, but I'm not sure if she's wearing it today. Long-haired girl in a school uniform with a white collar and a blue scarf. Also, she might be wearing a cardigan. Yes. I was going crazy because I couldn't talk to anybody about this Brucera thing. Please help me. All right. Well, at least we got some uh, progress on that side quest. And there are side quests everywhere now. Where were these side quests when uh, <laughs> when I was actually looking for them the first the first time? Oh well.